Hello everyone and welcome back to Alien Dawn and the Jungle. I hope you're all well. Thank you so much for joining me today and thank you so much for the support as always. You are all absolute legends and it really does, really, really does help me. So thank you so much for that. I'm actually going to work today on a little bit more production and just kind of getting up everything else we need. So what I'm going to do is actually just stick dartboard up out the way somewhere. <laughs> Let's put it there. And what I'm going to do then is uh, deconstruct both of these so they all should be sleeping inside three six we've got six beds so there's no no real reason for the uh the, the penalty of uh sleeping outside this should fix all of our happiness issues now i am going to try and do a playthrough one day where i don't get any meltdowns that would be good wouldn't it i'm also going to move this over let's start bringing some stuff maybe like i don't want them out in the middle you know i want them kind of no, I don't want that deconstruct. I want to bring you over here. And I want to get this kind of moved. I'm going to get the house up next. The diesel generators has just been researched. We've still got these hungry pests, but they're not doing much at the moment. What I'm going to do is make sure I harvest all this. And we are going to need potentially some storage soon. So, how long does this last under there? 12 days outside. So, we're going to need to then craft both. Uh, let's kind of go... 100 there it's going to cost us a bit but that's fine this one's almost ready for harvest so that's going to be good another 60 there tempted to expand that field as well we could get in our first bit here but i want to before anything else get up our house here and i'm actually going to have to plant some trees or carry on the way i'm going with cutting these trees down but that's okay i am going to go ahead potentially with let's stick with normal wood this time so we've got planks for the sleeping and i'm hoping not going to raise it. I am going to bring in the first building. I don't want to destroy these dandelion things where possible. I'm going to try and line it up to the next one. So let's go something like this. So let's. It's going to cost us a fair bit, but I think we'll go. Let's go with a 14 by 6 to start and the entrance point over here. This is going to be like the main room. All right. And then we can't do too much on this because I want to keep this here, but we are going to be able to go backwards. And then this area, once it's cleared, is also going to be... So I might go with, like, an L-shaped design again. I, I think that'll be worth it. Hungry pests are disappearing now, so that's fine. And we've discovered the energy crystals. Now, what that does mean, then, is we can get into some other things now. Is that right, with the energy crystals? Hmm. I'm trying to think here. I think I need to get back on more scavenging, too. Let's get salvage going on that. And then we've got some closer. We've got a few up here. There's actually like four up there. That crash down, which is good as well. I'm going to go ahead and harvest all these. So we're going to grab in what we can. I might be able to turn kimchi back on then. Rita has a risk of meltdown. So let's keep on top of this as well. So we're not facing our own tail. Soaking wet, drowsy, it's dark and hungry. We're soon out of the wet season. I know that much. And night vision goggles might get rid of that dark issue. So maybe we craft those. Can we have a look. Let's see. Signal. Craft a set of signal floats can be manual thrown and will illuminate the surrounding area on impact. So that's good during a thingy. Now, we did have a campfire that we desperately need to go to. So let's actually send Rita on that while she's unhappy. So she's punching a pole. Hopefully, she goes on that expedition and we can try and find someone. And Carter, suggesting a good old music night. Carter, that is a fabulous idea. Let's do it. Oh, man. Oh, guys, I've been testing out a new game as well called Clan Folk. So Clan Folk is effectively like Alien Dawn and RimWorld. And uh, I'm potentially going to bring it to the channel, actually. I just need to learn it a little bit more. And uh, I'd love to know your thoughts on that game as well. Like, I think it is really, really cool. We sent her off during the attack again. But that's fine. We've got the flamers now. So, yeah, I am going to be actually on that, hopefully, at some point as well. And if you haven't already, do check out my playlist of Anno. I've been playing it through, and it hasn't had as much love as I'd uh, hoped, actually. So uh, I don't want to have to uh, cut the season, if that makes sense. But uh, what have we got here? Hold on. Shogu. Ah, oh, that's the warthog. I think the striped animal with horns on its face should be named Shogu. After the fierce horned deity. Am I the only one who's heard of it? This animal is carnivore and packs a punch, should something decide to attack it. Oh, they'd be a good tamer then. So what do they... Let, let me just look into the taming of those guys. So we ha I know we haven't researched taming, but I want to see... That's the bulky animal. Where are they? I need to find one of these pigs. Pulling them pigs. So, 
They're an omnivore and taming food. Oh, nice and easy tame as well. I might actually grab those as my tame and I'm hoping you can set the work areas for the animals. That might be a thing. And kind of just leave them here as, as fodder. Killing fodder, you know? I think that's a good idea. But these energy crystals are going to come in real handy as well. Cure plant. Do we want to go down the mushrooms route? I don't think we do. We just want the happiness tea, which is fine. I think we have still got some in stock, so that's fine. With all the new changes and everything that's coming in as well, I would, I definitely, it does give, it does kind of lean into the sew and sell or the shop mode being really, really cool. Okay, what have we got here? Study the turret, research automated turrets, scavenge what you can. I found the ruins of a crude shelter and damaged automated turret. Oh, if you haven't already guessed, there's loads of new expeditions. This is good, so it saves us even researching automated turrets. But are we that bothered by that? Scavenge what you can. I'm feeling if I scavenge, we're going to get... I'm going to go scavenge. I know we probably should study the turret, but... Yeah, there we go. CPUs. Let's see how many she got. Was that worth it? Two CPUs. That was definitely worth it. That's actually really good. They're very happy with that. Cool. All right. So we actually need to grab everyone in now. So the attack has started. I was kind of miles away there. Let's get them all in. Carter just happens to be outside, and so do the other guys, but it should be fine. Uh, I don't think Rita's going to be back in time, but that's okay. We'll get Carter up in the tower here. And we should be fine. It's a few explodies, bigger ones. I think this is the look of the normal... Oh, no, poisonous scarabay. Look, this animal species is untamable. Causes poisonous wounds that make its victims sleepy. Ah, so there's poisonous animals now. That I didn't know. Let's bunch these guys as much as we can. They kind of actually all attack, you know? Let's get Racker up front with the with the spear here. And let's get these guys nice and close. There we go. This is good, though. We've got, they've got to come, see how they're walking away from the fence. This one's cutting in, but we, we can change that. They're getting in quite quick here. No, it's doing damage. The flamers are doing damage. That's what we want. Just to poke them down real quick. It's not amazing, but that's fine. We'll get a little bit of damage here, but not too concerned. Let's uh, kind of take these down then. Let's got to be careful of these poisonous ones. We kind of don't want those biting us, you know. I think we're fine though. Got to be careful of these flamers here. I don't know where the other guys are. You carry on chewing on that. So we'll stop sending Rita. Or well, maybe we'll take the weapon off Rita, you know, but we kind of want them for the... The expeditions, you know. Where's the other guys? Daniel doing up there. <laughs> Daniel just casually doing what he can, you know. We've got two slow coaches coming in as well. That's fine. Let's grab these guys then. A little bit weak. He took a bit of a beating. Um, that's fine though. We'll undraft all of these actually. And no, we don't want to draft you. Rita's on the expedition. Undraft. 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 Cool. I could have done them all actually. They were there by that time. Combat one for Vanessa, damage wooden tower. So what I'm going to do is create a little bit more of a funnel there. So I'm going to go ahead and do my next job is going to be the pole fences a little bit further. So we kind of bring them in. And then what we'll do is we'll, we'll kind of change it about and make sure that we've got the flamers. So three in a row will be enough for all of these, right? Now I'll probably bring it this way, actually. I think what I want to do... I want to do is deconstruct. Let me change this up. Welcome back, Rita. I'm actually this deconstruct noise is 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 kind of strange. I won't lie to you. I'm actually going to do that, and I'm going to go ahead and bring this. So I'm going to grab my fence. I know this kind of that is in line. Cool. And I'm going to eat that one. No, let's deconstruct that as well. Both of these pieces, and then we're good. Let's let them sleep though. I've just realized, actually, we also have this bit right... No, don't deconstruct. We have this open still. <laughs> Get that closed off, eh? Something just came into my flamers. I could carve these up, actually. Um, but let's go into research as well. This building is coming along nicely. Now, I wouldn't mind having a different kind of flooring here. We do have the cloth now. We could use a little bit of stone. Let's go ceramic tiles we got enough and then we're gonna have to mine some stones here you get 40 per stone here though so pretty good actually all round and then we'll just have a little bit in stock but we are okay there Carter's going back to salvaging i'm hoping he can get 
a weapon or two here. I do want to keep going out. So we've got one more use. Is it this one? One more use of the Armory Bay for Rita. So I am going to send her out again. And see if we get anything good. Uh, meal's still rotting away. Because we've still got some emergency rations here. I'm hoping they go and eat. Oh, what we didn't do? We didn't bloody build a table. What am I doing? That is a first for me. Uh, I guess we kind of get it in here. Now, where's the little kitchen unit going to be? Just for now, I, I want it like this, so then I can put these guys in. So we can get six round the table anyway. There we go, we'll have it there. What do we get? Smoke leaf and tea boiling, cool. And rotted away. Oh, no. Our fuel is rotting away. A work accident. Great. Okay. So she has injured herself, so she's coming back with nothing. I forgot how painful she was with that. Right, we need to get this covered. So I'm actually going to then copy these guys. And we are going to go ahead and move it over here. So let's just do, do this for now. And then I can actually put some bloody... Can we get the shelter over the top here? Let's just go stick and hay for now. Let's actually do this properly. Because that is getting my stuff lost at the moment. So let's just do that. And then we'll get that constructed, hopefully. And that'll get transported over. And then I can actually just empty and deconstruct this, I think. For both, actually. Let's go empty and deconstruct both. And then what I'll do is grab Daniel to come and construct all of these. There you go, mate. Do you want to queue up the rest of them? There you go. And then we should be good. I can transport all of this over, get all that done, and then no more no more wastage. And then we'll look to move these over, because everything does need moving anyway. And uh, this is just going to be like a bit of a basic area. I need to move these in. Let's start with the instruments in here. Uh, we're actually in the dry season now, if you look. So we are in the dry season. I think the temp stays the same. It's just affected slightly differently on that, so... That'll be interesting to see how that works. And let's move these guys over. So we'll slowly shuffle everything there and we'll release this area once we've got storage space as well. Heat pumping is done. Healing three and all of this. We still need more wood. I'm going to go ahead and cut down a hot... Not those. All right. We're going to go ahead and cut down the sausage palms and some more of these. We're still going to need more wood anyway, so that should cover us then. And hopefully I can get this constructed here. So I'm actually going to copy these guys in. I'm hoping I can get another one in there. So, there's a burn area that's not going to work. You see how the flamer doesn't have... Ah, we need to narrow our path. That's going to bug me, though. Okay, let's see if we can do this. So, narrow the path so they cover each other. We're going to copy this in. I've got a little bit of maintenance to do then, haven't I? This actually needs to come to here, and that needs to be there. And then I can cancel that. This cancel noise is so strange. And then we need to bring this this way. Let's copy that out. And then we should be back to where we were. Like that. So they'll come in. Does that look right? That will look right once it's built, I think. I'm just looking and we're slightly on a hill. You've got to be careful with the flamers on a hill. Another eight electronics and we're losing harvest here. So let's make sure these. Who's on Who's on that? Let's get... I'll tell you what, Daniel. I know you're cooking. I think you can also... Harvest. I know you're on a two there. Signal rocket? What's this? A signal rocket rises through the sky. It must be another survivor needing help. Wow. All right. Rita. I'm How far away? Six hours. Be fine. Let's get her on that as well. We've still got plenty of fuel. That is good. And we can get some of this uh, smoke leaf and tea, which will be handy as well. Harvesting is failing a little bit, but it's going to level him up. I can get him using that sort of things here. Vanessa's the only one that's kind of unhappy. Just burn out and hungry. Well, we'll have some good me meals soon. And there's the green grass now, so we don't even need the cobs. Fuel fermentation's nearly 60%. We did do that purple leaf. Hey, we got some coconuts now. 160 coconuts. So what I'm going to do, let's just pause it. I don't want them eating raw foods they shouldn't, right? So let's look. Meats, we don't want them on the raw insect meat. Let's close that one. Vegetables, we're fine there. Fruits, coconuts. All right, they're allowed to eat them. And they stay okay for a chunk under that. Okay, and other is that. So coconuts are okay. We don't want them eating grain. So we're going to copy this across to all of them. So no eating grain on any of you. So we should be fine now. 
I'll let them eat the coconuts for now. That is fine. We do have a lot of syrup, actually. Maybe we cancel that. I'm wondering if you could do, like, coconut milk, you know? That's what I was thinking. Uh, grain porridge, veggie soup. You can't do... No, let's get rid of that veggie soup there. No, that one should be until six. We're wasting that at the moment. That's fine, then. And meat soup I can get rid of at the moment. Tea... Not enough resources, so we need some dandelion spores. I thought we did harvest some of those. Signal rocket. I'm too late. A mangled body lies twisted on the ground not far from a crash site. I'd love to know the percentages on this one, actually. It'd be good, wouldn't it? I, wouldn't be, I won't be able to scavenge everything in one go, but I'll mark the spot. I should have... Oh, I clicked the wrong one. I should have buried the poor soul in doing some scavenging. She's on her way back without scavenging. That's fine. We'll get her back. We can send her straight back out. It's a pretty quick one. It's a... Uh, back in five hours and the food's already rotting away so the quicker we can get into some of this then so i think right we're gonna want let's start with one air conditioner kind of in here and then i think the bedrooms although i reckon the cold it doesn't even look like there's a cold system here so i don't even know if we're gonna need that carter is ill i was gonna say ill with dementia that no he's fine Immunity for swarm fever. He is fine already. Lovely. So we've got the antibiotics here. And I'm actually going to go ahead and copy in this box here. We're going to do the usual and get one next to every bed here. Just for healing. And then we'll let them sleep. Let's look at getting maybe a window or two over here as well. I, like I say, I like the scrap metal windows. I don't want to do too many because it blocks where you can kind of build. But we'll get one next to the door there as well. A little bit of natural light when they're inside, and once that flooring's done, we should be good. Let's go see if there's a little bit more stone as well. There is some out here. I don't want to mine that much just yet. There we go. We've got a nice little area here that we can build onto, so we are looking good. Um, I'd love to get this moved in once the roof's on. And there's fuel fermentation, so when we get the bug meat... that Which one's being mirrored, actually? So we're limit reach there, so this one we can... This one takes a lot, right? So we can always just do until 100, maybe. Uh, let's go. Let's go back a second. Let's get rid of that one and let's put this to like 150 or something. That's fine. Insufficient storage. So we're going to need some more space here. I think I can double this. Um, I don't see any reason why we need to have this stuff inside so if i just back this up here we'll have the double opening like we normally go for and we will effectively double this bad boy i think we could even go here and then we can get another strip there if we need it as well that's good loads of that stuff in and no queued research now so she is absolutely hammered the research here and we are well underway into a lot of our things here we can go into graphene cells i think we will do that because there's no reason to get the normal ones three days though oil extraction lotions i, I love the cereal coffee it's one of my favorites just because i love coffee so much <laughs> let's do graphene solar cells energy storage and then we should be good and we'll have a little look how's the building looking just pop the roof up a moment relatively far off still so i think we've got enough but rack is already on construction nine and this food is rotting away so i think what we're going to do is go into a i think we'll start a lot of our basics unpowered air conditioner i'm well aware now this target temp we're going to have at 18 degrees i'd set mine as at home and we're going to get in anything we need here as well so we can get the grain grass in if we want. So let's get a batch of grain grass over in this corner. Uh, let's go something. This can be relatively big, can't it? I think that'll be fine. We'll keep that going. We're going to cut down these trees, but that is okay. Ah, oh, the sausage palm dies, look. And then you can cut it down. So you've got to be careful with those. They do die in the dry season. That does lean into getting some kind of irrigation going, right? All right, they're just getting up, and Rita is getting herself a bit of food here, so we should be able to send her out on uh, an, another explore in a moment. Um, nope, let's cancel that a second. I'm going to take this weapon off her. So before anything else, I'm going to say nothing for you, Melody. Wow, you're looking pretty rubbish on your, your clothing here, aren't you? How's your fighting? Combat, Who, who's next up? Okay, Carter's good. I think we'll give it to Melody then. That's fine. 
Got another attack incoming though. Now getting a little bit bigger, which is nice. I do have four flamers now, so not concerned at one bit here. Let's see if the laser pistol's there. Happy days. And now we can send Rita out on the expedition. So I'm going to go... Although cruise ship free is good. I want to kind of explore for thingies to start. So let's get her going. Looks like they're already coming in. Let's not draft you. So let's grab these guys. And let's get them over here. And then Carter, you can go up on that tower. Melody up on that tower. And then these guys can be in the middle here. Kind of leave them there. Daniel, your fault, mate. There we go. We're all ready. Don't even know where they are. All right, here they come. Mostly explodies, which actually does work out for us, if anything. I'm going to bring them back a tiny bit here. Uh, that. There we go. Let's slow it down. Here we go. Let's have a look here. Let's get a nice, good check-in. Do photo mode, really. It looks beautiful, wouldn't it? But, yep, just the two flamers kind of covering us off now, so we don't even need to uh, worry too much. Nice, easy attack, isn't it? we got one more, and there we go. Job done. That was probably the quickest and safest attack we've had in a while. I'm not going to start carving these guys up until we have enough in the way of, uh, what's it called? Um, storage in a freezer-wise. I'm going to speed it back up, though, and let's check in. Food's still looking good. I think having those coconuts is going to help massively. I don't know if they last in the dry season here. I'm hoping we can still get dandelion stuff in. Wild plants. New discovery. As I gaze upon the seemingly ordinary fern before me, I couldn't help but feel a sense of disappointment. It appears to be nothing more than a useless plant taking up precious space. However, by cutting it away, we could make room for crops that would stain us for years to come. All right. Uh, I'm guessing that was something that's kind of weird, but cool. We'll take it. Lots of damage stuff. But we'll leave that. Um, let's look at our first bit of uh, normal wind turbines here. So where do we want... I think we could have a little power grid. Kind of feeling three over here. I just want to power this first bit. Exploration complete. Yes, these are the favourites, all right? These are the ones. This is why I go here. This is research. All right, new breakthrough. We're going to guess it. What are we thinking, guys? I am thinking it's going to be sleep training, right? We do this. You ready? Ah, it's all prospecting. I nor <laughs> normally get those right. All prospecting is not bad, though, if we mine stone, actually. Get a little bit of metal to uh, smelt up. And, uh, yeah, I couldn't believe we didn't get the table, though. It's kind of awkward, isn't it? So what we'll do, let's start straight away with a nice chunky... Although we've got the air con. We don't need the fireplace, actually. Let's get... Yeah, I don't even think we're going to need any kind of heating. I'm, I'm worried whether it just goes really, really cold or really, really hot here. I can't quite figure it out. The fact that it's red makes me feel like it's going to go really hot. Let's get in some ceiling lamps at the start. So maybe go in line. How many are we away from here? I want to be relatively good. Let's go there. Cool. There's our two ceiling lamps for the main first building here. And with this storage here, we could stay away from the owl shape. I did want to do that eventually, but we can look into that later. I want to build here. So we're going to need some kind of storage, and I want to move this stuff in. So let's go. Let's move you. The idea is we don't want... Hmm, I don't want it to be too far away to start. I think what we'll do is, firstly, get an area where this can be moved. So let's get... I kind of want these in the bedrooms as a light source. They do help. It's like a night light. They love it, don't they? And then we can kind of copy them in. I know that it does get a disturbed sleep sometimes because they kind of go in looking at each other's glitter things, but that's fine. What you can basically do is set up workspaces, can't you? You can have one bed, a work zone next to what they're supposed to be doing, and they're not allowed to move from there unless you draft them. I think we'll just get the main basic stuff in here. So, like... It can eat, work out and stuff. And then we'll get like a crafting zone over that end. This will be cooking kitchen kind of area with a bit of a workout zone. So let's put it over in this corner and let's move that punch bag in as well. We do want to be relatively aesthetic with it as well, you know. And let's get in our cook stove as well. So let's get in a bit of a metal cook stove kind of over here. So kitchen area maybe, I'm thinking. So that does mean we can have... Oh, then what do we do with the freezer, then? There is room here. Freezer doesn't have to be massive. 
We could cut off this point. What I could do then, actually, is reduce this field down one. I think that's a good idea. And then we'll have everything up to here. Opportunity. You know, I used to make the strongest moonshine back at home. What a legend. How I miss those times. Getting my basement raided by the coppers and such. Anywho, I reckon we have the, the materials to make a distillery here. And we most certainly have enough grain. Let's get cracking, huh? Do we have grain? Oh, we do. Problem is, guys, I don't want you getting hammered. You know, we could do some moonshine. We just do it. As he wants it, you know. What does it cost to make, then? I mean, we could do a little bit, right? I don't normally mess with this. I won't lie to you. Um, but grain, let's get distillation barrels over here for now. Once that's built, we'll have a look and see. I mean, what Carter wants, Carter gets, all right? He is the most important in our life. We do need some clothing, though. And Daniel is finally tailoring a bit more. If we got the cloth in now, we should be able... What I don't want to get is... Uh, I don't want them losing out on shoes. That is the worst one, right? So we're going to need some kind of... We need. To, I think we're going to go into uh, summer shoes, actually. They're pretty cheap. Let's get six summer shoes. I'm hoping the guys change their clothing out or we find some on an expedition, which we need to keep doing, by the way. We're going to go on another explore. Rita, I know I keep sending you out, but the, the research is saving me a hell of a lot on checking up on these guys. So if she can find, like, a Shrieker Nest, that'd be wonderful. Or we can find one. I, I don't think this map has them, though. All these, you know, and they're silicon deposits, I believe. Yep, 100 per, so that is... 2,600 silicon, and she's discovered a Juno. We are not taming a Juno, because that's human meat. And I'm sorry, but you can't... You don't have the ability to chop someone's limb off you just yet. They have to physically die. For you, Daniel. Looking at you, mate. Bless him. <laughs> He's always so happy, though. Right, graphene solar cells are coming in. Our first bit of electricity is good. Um, we need to actually get the power pole in here. Let's make it nice and neat. So we're going to need one just coming in on this section, so that powers this whole room. So we can get our lighting and our aircon going. So 24. These produce 40 on a good day. So we should have enough just for this room. Um, exploration complete as well. Huge chunk of an engine. So it would be nice to get a weapon of some kind. Electronics. We'll take the electronics. That is okay. Five. Uh, physical isn't the best, and that's about to rot away. Now, we go into this new season here. I reckon it's dry season, but severely. Does that make sense? If you don't have enough food, you're screwed. But we have coconuts. We have sweet syrup. I think we'll be okay. All right. I was just meant about in photo mode, actually. So what I will say is, basically, photo mode is identical to surviving Mars. So Vanessa also has swarm fever. We're going to need to keep on top of this. Need to make sure we've always got... Oh, we got 28. We're, we're okay. We're okay on that. So I'm not too concerned. Um, okay, and Vanessa, you are idling. What is going on here? So, let's have a look what we can get her doing. I guess because we are in a pretty good place, I think what we need is more crafting. So, let's get... We, we're still doing that purple leaf. Not enough resources. So let's go cut down some more of those. I Hopefully, it didn't die. Get a whole bunch of this cut down. Uh, we're going to need the actual purple leaf anyway. Vanessa can go and do that, can't she? Then we, she can stop kind of complaining. There's a lot of ore down here, and also the buttermelons. Look at all this down here. Wow. Oh, it's the edge of the map. I was going to say, that would have been amazing. Look at that. You could have just walled off the sides. Although, you can almost do it here. Nothing can spawn behind you. Hey, that's a good spot. So this is down by here. Weird, because... Oh, no, that's the edge of the map. Hey, we've got our summer shoes, and we've got some moonshine now. So, let me look into this moonshine here. What does it take? 100 grain. Let's always have five moonshine in then or something. I don't know. Melody motivated Daniel. And Daniel is tailoring our shoes that we're going to need for the heat here. I'm hoping this room... There you go. We've got our power in now. Power is officially good. So, this is running. If we wanted to, we could actually get our freezer room in with a couple of these. Um... Yeah, I think that's okay. What I need, though, is some kind of weapons at the moment. I want everyone to be geared up, you know. Graphene solar cells are almost there as well. And then I think we're in the batteries after. Let me have a look here. Energy storage, yes. And then we've got ore prospecting that we need to grab at some point. Um, never did test out the force field barriers either. I think what we'll do... Because, I mean, a lot of these... 
in all fairness, we need to like create the other things. So what we need to do is electronics crafting. So in order to get to that, we need to produce some silicon. In order to get the silicon, we probably need to take on one of those nests. But I want a sniper. The only way we're going to grab them is electronics crafting. So we need to potentially get some silicon, um, which we will get. Actually, graphene solar cells are done. Let's look at flare shielding is probably important. Let's just grab weapon crafting for now. Then, if worst case is we can grab some in, and there might be they might reduce the amount you can scavenge. In all fairness, um, and what I'm going to do, um, returns on risk of meltdown. What's her issue actually? I know she's just drowsy. It's fine. What I'm going to do. I think that should be okay at the moment. Let's let them sleep, and we'll pick it back up. Just notice we started a whole bunch of kimchi again, which used all our purple leaf. We still have 114 there, but we want... We need this, right? So this needs to go up. I think we can get rid of the bandages. I can maybe do... Do one of those. Let's get another good luck charm. And we've got no bandages in stock, actually. So let's do that first. Let's get 20 bandages for now. That should be okay. And we've got some meds then. We've still got the first aid kits, but I'd rather them not use that if they don't have to. Got no healing balm at the moment, but other than that, we're looking good. We've got a whole bunch of grain grass here as well. What is about to rot away here? Coconuts under roof. 36 days. You shouldn't be rotting away. Is, does the heat affect it? I know that can go. That's fine. Yeah, not happy with that coconut then. I could maybe get them to eat it, but that's fine. It now has gone into this red of the dry season, so I'm assuming then I'm going to say the temperature gets really hot. Now, I shouldn't assume, but don't think anything is harvestable during this heat is a problem okay that's fine now these are grown though through the next wet season we'll get loads of coconuts and there's our energy storage so i am actually going to put straight in um let's actually do let's do so i am going to do just a mini power grid here i'm actually going to get two of these i think we've got enough we've got 24 and then store hour wise i am going to get in Two batteries as well. And this is just going to be a little mini grid. So we'll be able to fuel up everything we're doing here. And I'm going to send Rita out again. Uh, she is cheering up a little bit. Cruise ship debris. We are going to keep exploring at the moment. Because we're going to try and get more researchers. Uh, seven rotted away. That's fine. Ah, oh, distress signal. Okay. Rita. Let's go. Expeditions actually. Hold on. Pause the game. Just a second. We're going to go... We want to go to that distress signal. We're going to cancel that one. We're going to do the distress signal. It's a little bit further away, but I think that's what we want to do. But guys, that's going to be where we end this one out. So as always, smash that thumbs up for me. If you are new around here, please do consider something to the channel as well. It makes the, makes the channel grow more and it means the world to me. And obviously, if you do want to become a member, do check that one out as well to help me that little bit more. As always, guys, do take it easy. See you in the next episode.